We have got new information about the night St. Louis police officer Caitlin Alex was shot and killed by fellow officer Nathaniel Hendren. Court documents say the two were playing some kind of roulette-like game with a gun. We've now learned Hendren and his partner accused of drinking while on duty. Casey Nolan also has new details from the partner's perspective through his attorney. Casey. Mike and Ann, this is where Chief John Hayden broke his silence today here at police headquarters, fighting back against accusations of a cover up. Then tonight we are also getting yet another side of the story from the attorney for Officer Patrick Reardon. Another twist in a story that's both bizarre and tragic. The night officer Caitlin Alex was shot and killed. The officer police say did it and his partner were drinking. That's according to an internal police misconduct report against officer Nathaniel Hendren and his partner Patrick Reardon. Court documents say Hendren and Alex were playing a game with a gun when he pulled the trigger and killed her. He's facing involuntary manslaughter. His partner Reardon has not been charged but is named in the disciplinary document. His attorney tells Five on Your Side he had, quote, a couple of sips of beer and stopped drinking. And when investigators tested his blood after the shooting, he, quote, blew 0.0. Hendren's attorney didn't comment on the report when he spoke earlier Thursday. I again urge everyone to keep an open mind and wait to see all of the facts when they come out. Then we can make decisions on what we believe happened in that room that day. I have no more comments at this time, but I thank you for your interest. Also Thursday, Chief John Hayden spoke publicly for the first time since the day one of his officers killed another and got heated when talking about accusations from the city's top prosecutor that his department is getting in the way of her separate investigation into how Officer Alex died. Let it be crystal clear that the accusation lodged by the circuit attorney, to say the least, was both offensive and insulting to the force investigative unit and myself. The circuit attorney Kim Gardner is standing by her criticism. She says the police department is using internal policies to prevent her from getting evidence that she needs for her independent investigation. As for rumors that are going around, Reardon's attorney says there was nothing else going on that night. In his words, Mike, no sex, drugs, or rock and roll. But Casey, we do know that Reardon and Hendren were not where they were supposed to be when all this happened. And we know that the chief announced some new policies to address that. Can you explain those policies? Well, Mikey says effective immediately, supervisors will be at roll call with the officers, reminding them of the importance of policing according to policy. He also says they will be checking the position, the location of officers on patrol every hour using radios and using GPS. But here's the thing, they have about 280 or so patrol cars, patrol cars. only 40 have that GPS technology, Mike. All right, Casey Nolan reporting live in downtown St. Louis. Thank you. The officer who police say shot and killed Officer Alex is now out of jail. He was released today after paying 10% of his bail. Nathaniel Hendren is now on house arrest. He is charged with involuntary manslaughter and armed criminal action.